The world's largest and most powerful bear is in trouble. And on this segment, we're gonna learn all about polar bears and how the Toledo Zoo is a conservation program aimed at saving these animals in the wild. Polar bears are well adapted for life in the Arctic. They have as much as four inches of thick blubber that helps insulate them and protects their core body temperature from the cold. Under all that fur, polar bears have black skin and their hair isn't really white. It's hollow to preserve the heat. Now these bears spend a lot of their time hunting and primarily eating seals, which mean that polar bears spend a lot of their time out on the sea ice. This is becoming an increasing problem for the bears because the sea ice is rapidly disappearing due to human activities. But thanks to the work of Polar Bears International and the Toledo Zoo, researchers are working around the clock to unlock the secrets of these polar bears. Here at the Toledo Zoo, we're really fortunate. We probably have the largest group of polar bears in the United States, and that's because we've been very successful with our breeding program. We've had four different litters in the past six years, and um, that is, that's pretty unknown right now. Um, both our females are well adjusted, they're very calm, and they've just been great mothers. So we're really, we're, we're really fortunate, as I've said. And it's really important because polar bears in zoos actually are ambassadors for their counterparts in the wild. If we can get people to be inspired by coming here and seeing these magnificent animals, hopefully they'll go home and do things like recycling and reusing and changing their carbon footprint, which actually does affect bears out in the wild. So for this species, um, the animals that people see in zoos really does have a direct link to their efforts and saving animals in the wild. So in addition to my work with polar bears at the Toledo Zoo, I'm also the coordinator for the Species Survival Program for Polar Bears. And what that is, is professionals from zoos work together to determine the best breeding pairs and placement of polar bears in different zoos. Our program also works on developing appropriate animal care standards, and we work with the government trying to help placement for orphan cubs um, and do things like give input and oil spill response. We also partner with other nonprofits. Our main partner is Polar Bears International. It's probably the top polar bear conservation organization. Um, they do a lot of work with conservation through research and education and we do a lot of joint projects. It's actually our main um, partner as far as receiving our Conservation Today funds. One of the projects that we've funded is a satellite collar project where the scientists in the field put satellite collars on the polar bears so they can track them year-round. And this way they can take a look at habitat use, survival of cubs, the size of the animals, you know, in a pretty stark environment. So. We've been working with Polar Bears International for over 10 years now, and, and it's a great partnership. So in addition to supporting polar bear conservation by visiting the Toledo Zoo, additional funds are raised through our Add a Buck program and keeper talks during private events. Well, I hope you enjoyed learning about the polar bears. And remember, by visiting the Toledo Zoo, you support this and other conservation programs like this. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you at the Toledo Zoo.